Hi, it's Harry. It's March 27th, and I'm here to give you a quick update on my air creek test. So, a few days ago, I uh, made a batch of air creek using a different soap solution uh, ratio. I did uh, one part soap to a hundred parts water because the previous batches I've made have been very brittle. So here was the first test. This was my control test. This is just Portland cement and water. I filled up a water container, I mean a soda container, and um, this was one and a half pounds of cement mixed with uh, two and a half cups of water. So it's solid, it's cured, it's smooth looking, a couple of air pockets. The next batch I made was Portland cement water, same ratio, one and a half pound cement to two cups of water. And I mixed the foam in by hand. This was 35 parts water, one part soap. And so this is the recommended soap ratio to make the foam. So I made it and it's cured. It's uh, still brittle. I feel like Superman. So um, anyway, again, this was mixed by hand. I took the foam and mixed it in with the cement that was already mixed with the water. And so anyway, this is how it's come out. And this is pretty much what I've been getting so far, even when I run it through the machine. So anyway, that's 35 to one. It's not much better with the uh, 50 parts to one. This is 50 parts water, one part soap. And it's still crumbly cement. And again, this is mixed by hand, not through the machine. This was the last one that I did, thinking less soap solution would be stronger. Um, and this is 100 parts water to one part soap. And I still have the same crumbly cement. So, so far, I haven't had any luck with a nice solid block of cement. So this was my test that I did here. Okay, so in this test, I'm going to do a foam mix. So I've done 35 to 1. I've done 50 parts to one and I've done 100 parts to one and I'm getting pretty much the same results and I think it's the soap itself affecting the cement from curing and hardening and staying strong instead of being brittle. So since that's what I believe I'm changing the soap solution again. So today I'm going to do um, one part soap, 200 parts water. So I'll be doing two tablespoons of soap solution in three gallons of water. So here's my gallon. Okay. Here's 
two tablespoons of Dawn Ultra Soap. Mix it in with the water, good. Now it gets stuck. So sticky, slippery. So that's in there. That's mixed. So now I'm gonna make some foam with that. And I'll see how the foam looks. solution 200 parts water one part soap I've already drained out whatever soap solution was in here with fresh water so I'll uh, put this on first thing to come out will be soap solution this is still water and this is the soap solution now. So now, this is the valve again, barely cracked open. And I'm going to put air on the system. Okay. So this is no air right now. This is here. So I'm going to increase the soap solution. Low the air. So what I'm noticing is I have to increase I have to increase the amount of soap solution that comes through to make the uh, bubbles come out, to make the foam come out quick enough. So it seems to have a pretty decent flow rate there. Just dump this bucket in. one more time because I'm going to make a batch of air creep with the green dragon same density as before because I have less soap in there now so maybe that's what I needed so I'll just I'll try this out and see if it works Okay, so we'll make some air creep. 
Let me show you first. It's my soap solution. I have Portland cement in here already. So I'm going to make a batch of Aircrete. With this soap solution to see if uh, I can get better results than I've been getting. Okay, but first I have to test the water flow rate coming out of the machine. So the recommended water mate water rate is um, one and a half gallons per minute. I've tried that. I'm gonna do a little less this time. I think I'm gonna try one gallon per minute. cement in a hopper already, that's why. That yeah, looks like cement. Okay, so I'm going to start my timer. I'm looking for one gallon a minute. pretty good. One minute. So I'm going to go with that because that looks pretty good. One minute. One gallon for a minute. So the water flow rate is set, the foam has been tested, the cement is in the hopper, and the foam is in the way. Okay, 200 parts water, one part soap solution, air creek test. Stop, I wasn't ready, I don't have to drill on yet.
a little different. Towards the end, the cement was looking a little darker. Okay, so there's my test. I'm gonna I'm gonna clean the yard soon. Not today though. Here's my mess. Testing grounds here. I'm gonna try my dome. See how this works out. really lumpy this batch compared to the last Personally, can't tell by the look anymore. So many times it's looked like it's been perfect consistency. Turns out it's not. So I'm just going to have to wait for this to cure to know for sure what I have. thicker than the last batches I've made. Okay, we'll see what happens now. It's my air creed test again. Um, I'll be back in a few days after that cures and let you know what I have. Alright, my green dragon family out there. Speak to you later.